video I have been emailing the people back that send me the emails and along with you know just a regular email I am now sending out update emails to see how their situation is going whether it be better or worse but you know I'm a slightly nosy individual maybe about that much and some of my ash tears are too don't think you I don't know but we're curious on how the situation went when it comes to some, if not all, of, well, I want to know about them all, if it comes to some of the videos. Oh, great. So this one came from, this was about the video where the son was recently meeting his father. Yes. And it says, Ash, my friend, was sleeping with his dad's friend, that's the one, and daughter. He chose not to stop. <sighs> Everyone found out, dad, friend, daughter, and friend's wife, Lord. It just said that. It says, Lord, all types of ish hit the fan. <laughs> That day, his father wanted to fight his own friend for making his son gay. He wanted to fight his son for being gay. And the wife wanted to fight everyone. And the daughter just cried because, as you said, she got pregnant. Oh, my God. This is one of them good old story with the update. Mm, 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 mm. Okay. She got pregnant and was pressured into making a decision about abortion, which she did. My friend isn't dealing with anyone, not even his father, and is trying to pick up the pieces. Thanks, girl. You tried. <clears throat> What can I say? I thought the girl would get pregnant. Because it's just like, I feel like when people do a whole bunch of sleeping around, flopping between beds and beds, in my mind, I visualize no protection being used. I don't know why, but it's just like, if you got enough, if you want to sleep, sleep, sleep here, sleep there, sleep there, sleep here, sleep there, sleep there, I'm thinking like, you ain't even bothering on putting on no protection or probably buying any. That's nasty. Anyway, the ish hit the fan in this story. <laughs> the daughter ended up getting an abortion. The father is no longer dealing with his son or his friend. It didn't mention if the wife divorced the husband. You know, probably the fact that they've been together for a long period of time and this might be the only issue. She may or may not want to divorce her husband. But if I found out that my husband of 70 years is sleeping with a man. Well, 70 years is a bit much. My, I think it was like, how many years was it? 45 or something? I don't know. But my husband of X amount of years is sleeping with a man. A man, someone with the same bodily parts as him, <laughs> Masaka, you got some answers. Like, I don't want to fool with you like that. I cannot trust you sexually and still, you know, do to do. I don't know about that. So she never mentioned if the wife wasn't dealing with her husband. But at the same time, it's just like she could also be blaming the husband for introducing this boy to their daughter, which in return got their daughter pregnant and had her get an abortion. Who pressured the daughter into getting an abortion? Probably her mama. Oh. That don't even matter. The fact is that she was pressured into getting an abortion. Is she a grown woman? 
but people do what they want. So if she wanted to get an abortion, that's something different. But being pressured and feeling like you have to get an abortion, maybe she was living with her parents. Don't remember that part. But you cannot, you should not be able to pressure a grown person into getting an abortion. And I do believe this girl was like 21 years old. How can you pressure a 21 year old into abortion? I mean, I want to say like, oh, if they're living in your house, you could do that, blah. How can you pressure a 21 year old? I mean, what if? Anyway, this was the, I don't know what it was called. My friend was sleeping with his dad's friend and the dad's friend's sister. No, the dad's friend's daughter. That's what we're going to call it right now. <clears throat> um, If you have anything that you want to chime in on down below, I am glad to hear it. <laughs> If you have any advice that you need, any comments or concerns, I want you to email me at wwasa day. Email me at wwashdo at gmail.com. I want you guys to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all of my other social media, and I will see you guys in the next one. Toodles! Let me say, I am not the one to sit around